Well, the airport explosions led to virtually every flight canceled. Now, here's a look at the arrival board, and it's the same story from top to bottom. Let's go now to CBS 2's Mike Parker at O'Hare for a look at beefed up security here. Mike. Erica, although city officials say there is no credible evidence of any threat against the city of Chicago, that is, a terrorist threat, those same officials, along with Homeland Security, are taking no chances. Have you ever seen this much security in Chicago at the airport? No. We heard that from more than one traveler at O'Hare today, and it's not surprising. Everywhere you look, you see Chicago police officers and TSA officers armed to the teeth. And then there are the bomb-sniffing dogs from the CPD, as well as Homeland Security. But passengers are reassured. Not only the dogs, the securities, the cops, you know. We have to be very careful with these terrorists running around like crazy these days. This woman is back from Nepal. Absolutely, I'm happy to see all the security here. I am. Just because it makes you feel a little bit safer, they're maybe paying a little more attention to what's going in and out of the airport. The uh, Department of Homeland Security National Operations Center, as always, uh, monitors the situation and they give uh, reports uh, back to us. So we've been receiving regular reports uh, since early this morning. There is ample evidence that uh, interim police chief John Escalante meant what he said when he said this morning he was going to beef up police presence at the airports. And the passengers seem to like it. Reporting live from O'Hare, Mike Parker, CBS 2 News. Erica? All right, Mike, thank you.